thought were ruining his bread supply. What was unusual about the alleged criminals? Join us after the break to find out. <laughs> Guess what? Voxel are paying me to show how incredibly spacious the five-door Corsa is. Fine, I said, but we go to Beverly Hills and I call the shots. Ruby, my darling! Not now, Zsa, Zsa I'm shopping. You see, there's loads of boot space, not to mention coat, hat, and dress space. Cute. And the course has got lots of room in here. Well, I'll need some help to unpack. The Corsa from Vauxhall. The small car with the big personality. New Argos catalog, take one. Oh, cut, cut, cut! I said take one! The New Argos catalog is out now. If you're finding your stairs a bit of a struggle, here are three steps to an easier life. Step one. Call Acorn Stair Lifts on free phone 0800 19 19 19. Step two, chat to our salespeople. You'll discover not only can we fit a stair lift the following day, but they're also a lot less expensive than you might think. Step three, glide up and down your stairs in comfort and safety. Call Acorn Stair Lifts now on free phone 0800 19 19 19 and give your life a lift. Barrett can offer for sale a wide choice of older homes acquired through our famous part exchange service and at prices below valuation. We call them oak leaf properties. Many come fully redecorated and include fitted carpets and up to £500 towards your buying expenses. And you can even part exchange. It all adds up to a great deal more from Barrett. For your free property guide, ring now on 0345 62 63 64. Got a kitchen, got a pan, got vegetables, got a pan, got a fridge, got no plug, got a sweet and sour meal maker, blah, blah, just had chicken, pork or vegetables, got a generous meal for two. Chop, add meal maker. Simmer and serve. New one pound meal makers from Cross and Blackwell. Now there's a thought. Hello, John Cleese again. As you can see, my employers at Norwich Union Direct have very kindly arranged for my brain to be transplanted into a man with absolutely no personality at all, so that their message can come over untainted by the comedy connotations that my physical presence has apparently been adding to it. So the message is, once again, very seriously, and this time almost anonymously, that Norwich Union Direct can protect your car and home for less. Welcome back. Before we went into the break, I asked you what was unusual about four suspects accused in 1993 by a Kenyan shopkeeper of ruining his bread supply. Well, the alleged criminals were four rats. I'm not quite sure what the sentence was, although I have a horrible feeling I can probably guess. Let's take a look at our score and see that James is in the lead at this point as we move into round three with 90 points. It's very close and anything can happen in round three. This time, you can play in a much more cunning way because you can not only pick numbers off the board, you can also pinch from the other contestants, making it difficult for them to score. A buzz around, general knowledge, so again, you have to be fast with your hands. Here goes. Which veteran radio disc jockey is famous for referring to his listeners as pop pickers? James. Alan Freeman. Yes, Alan Freeman or Fluff. What are you going to do, pick or pinch? I want to pinch uh, number 11 from John and put it in day B, please. So the 11th of July, 1952. Which South African golfer known as Bobby, although his initials were AD, won his third Open Championships in four years? Is it Pickering? 
No, I'm afraid not. It's lock, James. So no bonus points there. In which sport did France Clammer win world titles? Anyone make a guess? John. Boxing. No, anyone else? James? Football. No, it was skiing. Which device invented by Martin and Baker has been saving the lives of fighter pilots since 1949? Anyone? Barbara? Joystick. <laughs> no, it's not. Anyone else? James? The ejector seat. Yes, it is the ejector seat. Yes, pick or pinch, James. I will uh, pinch number four from John and put it into dear B, please. <laughs> Still July 1952, this time the fourth. Which Australian beat Drobny in an exciting Wimbledon men's singles final by three sets to love? Was it Frank Sedgman, Mervyn Rose, or Ken McGregor? Mervyn Rose. No, it was Frank Sedgman. You're getting all the sporting questions here, James. Which British actress, famous for films like Alfie and Deep End, wrote a best-selling book entitled Calendar of Cakes? James. Beryl Reed. No, anyone else? John. Jane Asher. Yes, it was Jane Asher. Yes, good guess there. Pick or pinch? I shall pinch 52, please, from James and put it in year A. So you're also changing your date line, the 6th of May, 1952. The death occurred of which Italian educator and originator of the method which bears her name based on a child's creative potential self-discovery and spontaneity i can't remember and i was a teacher as well i'm sorry oh you probably will kick yourself john when i tell you it was maria montessori oh yes which comic celebrity has sung for and that brings us to the end of round three let us see who is going to go on and play a date with a decade Barbara is in third place with 50 points, John in second place with 80 points, James held his lead in that round on 110 points. <laughs> but it was very close, it could have gone anywhere in that round. John and Barbara, thank you for being very good contestants on Backdate. You take away with you a personal organiser with lots of dates you can play around with them to your heart's content. Thank, thank you, you both. Thank you. James, would you join me, please, to play A Date with a Decade? <laughs> James, congratulations. Thank you, Valerie. Which decade are you going to choose? I'm going to go for the 1990s. No, of course, we only got to 96, so that will take us back into the end of the 80s. Right. Any reason? Is that because it's a recent few years which you remember, or do you have good memories of this period? Well, there was the Berlin Wall, and I went to Venice as well, and I was also involved in the, the poll tax riot in 1990. Mm. Not, not um, doing anything you shouldn't no, do? No, I was in the middle of it, getting the bottles fired up, mate. Let me tell you how we play our date with a decade. I'm going to name nine events, and you have to match those events to the years on the board. If you're uncertain about one, don't waste time, move on, we can mm -hmm. come back to that. As you answer, a bit of face will be revealed from the decade mm -hmm. that you've chosen. And at the end, when you've got all those dates right, I will then ask you to name the face. And I give you five seconds to do that, mm -hmm. 60 seconds to name the events. But the face is all scrambled up to make it rather harder for you. So, are you ready to start? Ready as I'll ever be. All right, here goes with the clock. 100 metre goal for Christie at Barcelona Olympics. 92. Yes. Hugh Grant arrested in Los Angeles. 95. Yes. Desert Storm launched against Iraq. 91. Yes. The Queen celebrates her 70th birthday. 96. Yes. Nirvana rock star Kurt Cobain dies. 94. Yes. Mrs. Thatcher resigns as Prime Minister. 90. Yes. Sky Television launched in Britain. 88. No. Kenneth Clark replaces Norman Lamont as Chancellor of the Exchequer. 93. Yes. 19 year old Graf wins Tennis Grand Slam. 88. Yes. Sky Television launched in Britain. 89. Yes. <laughs> You did that, James, in 29 seconds. You now have five seconds to look at the face, and I will then ask you who it is. Who is the face of your decade? It's Chris Evans. Let's take a look. It is Chris Evans. Yes, very well done. Chris Evans, of course, won a BAFTA award in 1995 for Don't Forget Your Toothbrush. So you have won our splendid leather-bound book Thank you very All much. All about events of this last century. Well done. <laughs> Thank You're you very much, You're an excellent contestant. Thank you for playing. Thank you. Well done.
We'll be back again, of course, at the same time to play another game of Backdate. Until then, with three new contestants, goodbye for now. Well, quiz time continues next here on Channel 4 with Captain Richard Whiteley at the helm of the Good Ship Countdown. That's next. quote on your household insurance phone that west no forms right. no fuss Thank you very much out or i get the mint sauce come on chop 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 out come on that's my jumper <laughs> call that west on 0800 24 24 25 Barrett can offer for sale a wide choice of older homes acquired through our famous heart exchange service and at prices below valuation. We call them oak leaf properties. Many come fully redecorated and include fitted carpets and up to £500 towards your buying expenses. And you can even part exchange. It all adds up to a great deal more from Barrett. For your free property guide, ring now on 0345 62 63 64. Does the used car you're buying have a hidden history? Phone 0345 40 50 60 and give it the HPI. For an instant quote on household insurance, phone that West on 0800 24 24 25. No forms, no fuss. Before you cut your hair, stop and think. What if you could protect your hair as you color? Now you can, with Excellence Cream from L'Oreal. A nurturing cream rich in moisture. Excellence Cream protects your hair. It doesn't drip and really covers gray. What I love is the color, the healthy feeling, like it's full of moisture. Excellence Cream, the protective cream colorant from L'Oreal. It's a cream. Think about it. The day the world's finest air force went on strike. I had a deep, fired anger within me. A story untold until now. We were the forgotten army. The war was over and they were getting on with Civvy Street. 100,000 military personnel in open revolt. But the penalties for mutiny are severe. I will execute, shoot, one of that ten. Mutiny in the RAF, tonight at nine on Channel 4. This is Channel 4.